Let's reduce or remove transparency on liquid glass. Now, if you open up, say for instance, the Photos app, you can see here the liquid glass gives this weird transparency that makes everything harder to read. I'm gonna walk you through some steps to get that fixed, and we'll use this as a baseline, kind of what that looks like. So the first thing we're gonna do is get into your settings. Within the settings, there are a couple different things that we can do to change that and essentially reduce the transparency. One is it says actually reduce transparency. So we can turn this on and I'll show you what it looks like. Now this won't do everything to put it back to normal. You can see here it does have it normal at the very bottom. You'll be able to see it's just a white outline instead of that liquid glass feel. However, there's other steps that you can take to remove that transparency because you can see if you swipe down from the top right, you can still see that liquid glass look on there. So you have a couple different options as well. Let's go back into your settings. And another option within accessibility is to increase contrast. By doing that, you'll be able to see the entire background turns a little darker and the buttons turn a little whiter. So if I go back into my photos, everything really stands out and looks really strong and you'll be able to visually tell the difference between different things. Now, this is one option, but actually in iOS 26.2, they built in the ability to reduce the transparency or essentially turn off or minimize liquid glass. To be able to do that, let's hop back into your settings and I'll show you what that looks like instead. So let's go back to the very beginning, turn off, reduce transparency and increase contrast. And we'll compare it to what this looks like. So go back to the very beginning of your settings. And within the very beginning of your settings, you'll be able to see a brand new option under display. It says liquid glass. You can either use clear or you can switch this to tinted. And it kind of gives you an idea. Essentially, it takes those clear backgrounds or menu items or anything like that. And it kind of makes them a bit more frosted. I'll show you what it looks like. You can open up the photos. And now if I scroll through, it still has this, but you can see it's a bit more visible and clear to be able to see all of the menu items. Again, if I swipe down from the top right, it still has that liquid glass look and feel, but all of the buttons and everything are a bit clearer. Depending on your preference, you can turn on or off any of the ones that I just showed you.